Good morning, this is Connie and welcome to a new week of Making It Work. I have just got two weeks left before I take a three week break and let's get started. First thing I'm wearing today is my Milani Easy Brow Tinted Fiber Gel in medium brown and it is not too dark. It, it looks just fine. Some of them are so dark in medium and some are just right and this one's pretty good. Okay, then I wore my Ulta Eye Primer. I'm wearing the Roller Lash by Benefit. Deluxe sample size. I'm wearing my Catrice Highlighting Powder in Stardust. Very pretty. And I'm wearing my, for my blush, I am wearing uh, my Morphe 9N palette. Come here. Which a lot of these are going to be used as eyeshadows because these down here are way too dark. But I am using this one here today. And I will probably continue to use through this one this week. So I will show this every day. Then for my eyes this week I'm use, wearing the uh, Makeup Revolution Professional Eyeshadow Palette Neutrals versus Neutrals versus Neutrals which I kind of don't get but anyway um, I am wearing let's see this on my eyes today or this for my base this for my transition and this one on my lids today. So those three. Just a very light eye look today. And then I'm wearing the uh, Laura Geller lipstick in Mocha Mauve today. Just a plain old kind of classy looking case. And this is what it looks like. It's, pre it's pretty dark, but it'll do. It's fine. I like it. So put that one there. So anyway, I hope your Monday starts out good. Mine is fine so far. It just the weekend goes so fast. <laughs> so fast. See you very soon. Bye-bye. Good morning, everybody. This is Connie. Of course. <laughs> it's just a habit to say that. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> anyway, it's Tuesday morning and welcome to Making It Work. Um, today I used my Morphe palette. It is the 9N palette. And I used the second color here for my blush. I used my Makeup Revolution Neutrals versus Neutrals. And I used, let's see here, I'm backwards. So I used this color here. Then I used this color here for my base, or for this was my base. This was my transition. And this is my um, eyelid color today. That is a, um, sorry, I'm blinding you, aren't I? Ah, that is a like a rose color, very pretty. Light rose color. And that's what it looks like. And then on my lips today, I'm using the melted lipstick, uh, melted metal lipstick in Melted Metallic Peony. And it is very pretty. I love this color. I like the peony and I like the metal one. Uh, metal one, of course, is a lot shinier. Very pretty pink. All right, guys, that's my Tuesday. I'll see you tomorrow. Hey, everybody. Bye -bye. And welcome to Wednesday's edition of Making It Work. We're going over the hump today, so... That's always a fun day. <laughs>
we've been so busy the last couple of days. We catered a big party yesterday. So um, I had my stuff to do plus making salads for them and that. So it was, it's been a very busy couple of days. And plus I make sandwiches for all the ball players too when they go uh, out of town to play. Yeah. That's a lot. Um, that is 19, 19 players, and then you have to double it because you have to give them two sandwiches each. So, yeah. Anyway, this week I am using my Makeup Revolution, Neutrals versus Neutrals. And as usual this week, I am using this color here for my uh, base, and then this color for... I'm getting a lot of, okay, and this color for, whoops, never mind, this color for my uh, transition. Today I use the gold color, and it comes out a really pretty light gold when you first, your first application, but the second application it turns deeper, and it's really pretty. I, I put it on twice. Very pretty. Okay, and then for my blush, I'm using my um, 9N palette by Morphe, and today I use this darker shade here for my blush. And I've used a lipstick I haven't used very much because I'm not a fan of the color, but I'm going to wear it today anyway. Um, it's by Cargo and it's called Dubai. And this is what it looks like. Just, I don't think the shade really suits me. Um, you guys let, let me know what you think about it, but I am not a fan. I wish I could walk around all day like this. Get my forehead lifted. <laughs> anyway, thanks for joining me today, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good morning, everybody. This is Connie, and it is Thursday. And here is what I'm wearing today. For my eyeshadows, I'm using the Revolution Neutrals versus Neutrals. And today I'm wearing this. I'm trying to get that. This on my... Uh, for my base, this is my transition, and I am wearing this color on my as my eyeshadow today. And for my blush, constantly knocking something off. Um, there's they're getting too dark for me now. So I used this color here for my uh, blush today. There's really only four blushes I feel comfortable using. And that is the top four and this one. And even this one is pretty, pretty bright on my skin. I had to wipe some of it off. And on my lips today, I'm wearing the um, Their Real... Uh, Sexy Lips, I think. I cannot never remember what that's called. Big sec Sexy Lip Kit. <sighs> Benefits, they're real. Big Sexy Lip Kit. There we go. <laughs> and this is what the outside looks like. You open this up. Down here at the bottom, you just screw it up. And that's the color I'm using. Let me look and see what... It's a little bit bright for work, but, oh well. I dabbed it a couple of times even. This one is called, and I can't see worth a darn. It's because it was upside down. It's Pink Thrills. And you can, you can tell the difference. Um, not so much now because I like this, you know. But, um. It's very pretty. I like this color. 
The only thing is, I just think it's a little bit bright for work. That's all. And I might as well forget ever having a good hair day when I'm working. <laughs> you know, because my hair is flattened back. I put this over my head, so all of my hair is flattened back all for eight hours, or seven and a half hours a day. So it never looks good. Never, ever. Anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. And we're six days away from three weeks off. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Happy Friday, everybody. Oh, my hair looks so bad. <laughs> you got to remember, I have this on my head all day. I did not wash my hair this morning. I'm going to wash it as soon as I get home from work. So it looks really bad right now. I'm sorry about that. Ugh. Anyway, what's on my uh, face today and my opinions is... Okay, the first thing was my um, Milani Easy Brow in, and I'm really seeing blurry this morning, so um, medium brown, and I really like this. It's not too dark whatsoever. It is a good color for me that, I, I mean, I... I don't like the really dark. Um, I think this suits me better, the lighter dark or lighter browns. So this is some of the really, really dark ones I think that I will um, probably get rid of because, you know, I was on this quest to find the right colors for my brows and the dark colors just don't suit me. So anyway, and then, of course, my Ulta Eye Primer, which I absolutely love, and now I have two backups. <laughs> um, Benefit Roller Lash. I like it. Except for it's really hard to get off your lashes. I have a hard time um, getting this off because it is waterproof for sure. Which is good because I have watery eyes, but then again, it's really hard to get off your lashes. Um, so, that's that's my only thing about it. Otherwise, I really like it. Uh, Catrice Highlighting Powder in Stardust. I don't think this one's as good or as glowy as um, Champagne Campaign. Maybe it's the brush I'm using this week. I don't know, but it's very hard to see on my cheeks. Uh, Makeup Revolution Palette, Neutrals versus Neutrals. And today I wore this as normal on my base, as my base. This as my transition color. Then I used this color, wait, this color, this kind of reddish um, color for my eyelids today. I didn't think that would be as... Um, strong as this one so I didn't use that one and um, this is a much better palette than than the um, is it the iconic is that what it is iconic um, I think they've upped their game a little bit even though this is super powdery very super powdery but it is still um, and it takes you know if you want something a little deeper you have to work at it a little bit but it's still for the money it's a good palette Morphe um, 9N I'm not super impressed with these blushes uh, they're okay but um, these down here are so dark for me I can't wear them um, same thing with these so there's only four in this whole palette that I can wear and there's, there's more palettes that I can't wear, or more shades that I can't wear than there is that I can. So that's why I'm not. Um, otherwise, the you know, it, they're pigmented. They look nice on your skin, the four that I can wear. So um, the other ones I can use for eyeshadows, but why? So I'm not real impressed. I don't see myself using this a lot. All right, so for my lipstick today, I wore Laura Geller 
in cranberry and it is much too dark for work. I put it on and I realized exactly how dark it is. Um, so I topped it with matte blissful and it didn't help it a whole lot it just made it more pink. <laughs> it's still dark but it, it's more of a wearable. Um, it doesn't look so red. So I'm I, with the matte blissful by uh, Milani. So anyway, the rest of the lipsticks I wore this week, um, Monday I wore the other Laura Geller, then Tuesday I wore the Cargo, which I wasn't real impressed with. Um, Thursday I wore the Their Real, um, Big Sexy Lips, Big Sexy Lips, yeah, um, which I liked. Oh, one of those days, maybe Wednesday, I wore the Melted, and I really like that. I like the Melted lipsticks. So anyway, that's my lipsticks. That's my makeup for the week. And thank you so much for joining me this week. Uh, we have today. I said yesterday that we have six days left. We had seven. So counting today, I have six days left before my, my winter break. So I will have next week, I will have... Um, my last week uh, of making it work for three weeks so I'll do I'll try to do two or three get ready with me in that time so it'll be fun I'll try to do catch up on making lots of videos because I know I've only got a couple up this week so I'll see you next week bye bye